PC Crash 14 lets you enter velocities directly into sequence table and the controller will apply braking or acceleration in order to have the vehicle match those velocities. So what I have here is a vehicle loaded into a triangulated point cloud. See it's a complex curve. And let's say that we have EDR data. So if I'm going to bring up my sequences, I'm going to go to sequence tables. You see now we have a velocity table. You can still import velocities into the braking acceleration table and it will calculate the accelerations required to meet those velocities, but that's on the flat. So if I'm going to import a file, you'll see that we've got a five second countdown to impact and let's say these are my velocities over that time. I'm going, if I hit apply, uh, you'll see that's all pre-impact, so I want to offset that to after time zero by adding five seconds to everything. Okay, and now if I run my simulation, my vehicle goes around the corner here, and we're actually leaving a bit of a tire mark on the inside. At least we're exceeding uh, friction. So I just stopped the simulation at about seven seconds, and if we take a look at our uh, values window you'll see that we follow the prescribed velocities over time until we reach the end. Uh, let's just take a look at time instead. Until we reach our five seconds, which is where our sequence table ends, and then uh, it doesn't apply any more acceleration or braking. So if we take a look at our uh, tire brake forces, you'll see that uh, there's actually uh, some uh, uh, applied forces here in order to get it to do this. You see the acceleration, the longitudinal acceleration uh, required to have it match the speed. And it breaks a little bit and then it applies the gas. And then this acceleration here is just due to the slope. There's no braking applied after that. So you can see as we go around the corner here, we will match the uh, speed indicated by the EDR. Whereas previously we would have to try to figure out accelerations to account for the slope and the cornering ourselves. So that's a nice new feature in PC Crash 14.